welcome back to Skyrim. All right. Well, I'll tell you what. Uh, been doing a little bit of sort of uh, housekeeping, uh, maintenance, uh, whatever you want to call it. And I actually managed to get my carry, my actual weight carried down to 213. Part of it was in the potions I was carrying. I had so many. There were several things that I was carrying like 30 and 40 of. I had I had 70 of these stale blood potions, and I don't need to carry that many at once. I should clear that out and trim it down every now and then. I dropped 100 pounds off of my carry weight just by trimming the potions I was carrying. Yeah, and so that helped a lot. And and also, I, I was doing, I've been doing something else, too. When, uh, you know, every time I get up to a decent amount of cash, what I do is I go in here and I put most of it in there. And I currently have 111,000 gold. Cool. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I just noticed that and thought I'd throw it out there. But there is something else. Uh, uh, yes, I have a level up to take care of and I will. The Nightingale Bow. 85 damage. It's a very good bow. And when I got it, it was the best thing I'd ever had. And then I got the ability to do so, and I improved it with to legendary skill, or legendary capability. And that's great. And at some point, I will be able to improve it more once I max out enchanting and so on. But I think now, much as I like the bow... Uh, well, it's, uh, I think it's time to put it away. So, yeah, here's place. Okay, Nightingale Bow is put away. It's done with for right now. So, I'm going to stop in here. And I have got a mess of stuff in here. And what I'm looking for, Ebony Bow. Let's see, do I have glass bows in here? I do have, okay, I'm going to leave them for right now because I don't have glass smithing. Well, wait a minute. Level up. I'm thinking there might be two in there. Uh, let's throw this on stamina. Okay, I don't. All right. Okay, I think I know what I want to put this on. In archery, let's put overdraw five of five. Bows do twice as much damage now. Great. All right, now let's head down here. No, wait a minute. Oh, yeah, I do need to come down here. I, yes, I need some ebony. And it's time to, let's see, ingot, ebony, I'll put back what I don't need. Okay, now, in here I need the armor, this, 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 and the notched pickaxe, and oh yeah, let's get one of these. Yeah, 106% sounds good to me. Okay, now get this stuff put on. 22% and 22%. Another 22% and 20% for that. Go to weapons. Equip the notched pickaxe. Okay. And now just a quick dry run. Ebony bow. 88. And apparently it's already legendary. Or that would be what it... Let's see. Do I go... Let's see. No. Alright. Exit out. Exit out. Yeah. Potions. 
fortify smithing. Let's get in here and do it to it. Ebony bow can now go to 130. Yes, please. Dagger. Okay, the daggers are now at 116. Oh, sweet. That's great. All right. I'll put this get up away. Okay. There. That. And the pickaxe. Okay. Eminent sneaking. All right, and then let's check this bow. 130 damage. Oh, that is sweet. Let's favorite that. And Okay, that needs to be recharged. What? Get me that. I meant to hit E or T, not E. There. And this one could be charged up a little bit too. Okay. Not bad with that stuff. All right. Now for some enchanting. Because the bow really does need to have something else on it. And this thing ought to be really kicking some butt here. Okay. We have Fortify Enchanting, 26% stronger, I shouldn't need more than two of them, okay, oh wait a minute, whoops, hang on. I need to get out the black soul gems because shouldn't actually need more than one of those. It, whatever. All right. All right. The the bow. And the enchantment, I think shock damage would be a good one. It fits. Enter, yes, and this, and a black gem. Okay, and that's going to be one valuable bow. Yeah, all right, hang on here. Quit enchanting. Let's get that potion in place and do it for real. Fortify smithing or enchanting. Okay. The bow. Grand soul, the black soul gem. And shock damage. Crank it all the way up and hit enter. And then hit R to craft and hit yes. All right, now. Let's see how it came out. 130 damage, 25 points of shock damage, and half as much magic at damage. And it's worth 5,700 gold. Oh, yeah. All right. And let's go ahead and get this on. 
I know I had it favorited. Ebony bow. Oh, yeah. Four. There we go. Oh, for crying out loud. Why is my dagger not... There. And the bow. Yeah. All right. Now, now that that's all out of the way, quick save. And the uh, quest log here. Lost to the Ages from last time with Katria. The next place to do is, the thing to do is to search for the Ethereum Shards. And look on the map. And that's up here at Ralbathar. So I'm going to head up there. And yes, I'm going to just ride with Shadowmere and go cross country because I feel like it. And so on. And I'll catch you when I get up there and we'll get into Ralbathar and have a look around. All right. I have just about arrived at Ralbathar. It's just ahead here. And you can tell because of these guys hanging out out front. And I figured this is a great opportunity to try out the new bow. Excellent. And with 3x damage for a sneak attack, that makes it even better. Okay. Let's be sure to do that. And you don't come to think of it. He hasn't fed in quite a while either. Okay, that means he's gone up in rank. Blooded vampire, stronger, a little more powerful. And... Finish that one off. And then we'll head inside. Okay. All right, into Robothar. Haven't been here for quite a while. As a matter of fact, I believe it was a Dark Brotherhood quest to tend to a contract. Elaine Dufont, as a matter of fact, yes. Armor exploding ice bolt schematic. I'll take it. I don't need it, but I'll take it. Actually, I can concern myself with this stuff another time. And then there's this guy. Sucks to be him. Hello? Thank you. And one more time. Like I said, sucks to be him. Ah, oh, yes. This is a trap that I've seen so many people try to just bull through it, run right straight through the flames. Make it easier on yourself. Go around it. Same as before, except Elaine Defont is not there anymore. Uh, lock picking skill is on my list of things to do. Although I'm doing pretty decent. No! 
yeah. Just continue extracting the blood potions. They will no doubt come in handy sometime. And of course, extract all the goodies. But, oh, oh good grief, he's still here? Okay. Yeah, there's all sorts of stuff in here. Oh, we have a party guest in there. Can I shoot through this? Someone there? You didn't notice that? Gee. Beautiful. All right. Come on. All right. I guess we're heading in. Machinery is reliably not stopping as always. song it's level up time and just for giggles let's do it now instead of waiting all right um health sounds appropriate archery critical shot steady hand two already got eagle eye hunters discipline quick shot draw both 30 percent faster um, yeah. And quick save. I don't want to lose that. <laughs> okay. Oh. And sneak. Wait till this comes down. Jump. Ooh, that was that hurt. Now usually oh Usually I was going to say there's a way to turn that sucker off up on this end of things. Okay. I'm going to have to try using my vampiric life drain on the robots up here just in case it would actually be crazy enough to work. There's a solution. Just jump over the doggone thing. Of course, I do have a little bit of an advantage in that. Uh, the better Vampires mod, for some reason, increases your jump capability. I can jump like 160% of normal. Oh, I was 
just going to try using that on them. I have to remember to do that. Okay. It looked like a bow. Really? <laughs> Master level lock. Yeah, this one's still a little touchy. Oh, come on. Oh, close. That was real close. Yeah. Oh, come on. All right, farther this time. Maybe too far. There we go. Cool. All right, and I am now loaded down and cannot run. Which I don't actually mind. I know it can be annoying to some folks watching, but Uh, I'll deal with it best I can here. All right, one of those famous elevators going down and... Okay, Vampiric Drain does not work on the robots. I suppose I kind of expected that, but... It's worth testing. Okay, and this is a good place for a brief break because interruptions are us. Okay, let's quick save and hit the lever. Let's see, Robothar, if I'm not mistaken, doesn't that go down into Black Reach? I guess we'll find out. Oh, uh, yeah. Over here, get on this thing to get around most of that. And then, when it's up there, get down here, around, and away from it. I've seen these things before, and there's always been a, a lever or some some place, some kind of control to turn it off. Oh my, Falmer, why well, aren't you special? Sneak? Why well, I wasn't? I don't know. Oh, crap. What the? Do you see this? Synchronized movements. Oh, boy. That was weird. Oh. All right. At least I got my arrow back. Oh, come on. All right, let's off this guy first. <sighs> All right. 
dagger, open the gate, and nail the rat. You don't want to hold E too long on these things, so you end up picking it up and throwing it all over the place. All right, what do you got? Oh, you're disgusting. Sorry, lady. Nothing personal, but you don't need it anymore. Okay. Nice. These Palmer are going to have me loaded up on these blood potions. All right. Do you have a chest in there? No. All right. All right. It's necessary slow going because of how loaded down I am. It's amazing how fast it happens. But, yeah, I suppose it's what I get for taking absolutely everything. Okay. Takes care of him. It. Whatever. anything of interest up here well there's a chest and that sort of adornment uh, looks forsworn apprentice level a little easier to deal with have a chest in there. No. I get the feeling I need to go up. Actually, how about if I consult the map and its handy dandy arrows? I need to go over there. Oh, I hate telephones. All right, well, that's taken care of, and uh, while I was out, I took a opportunity to examine how much time I have been going here, and I'm right just about at 30 minutes right now. So... I'm going to clear these guys out and make sure there's nobody else here on this level. And then what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to get them looted and move all their stuff back out towards the entrance and put it in a container there. And then we'll pick this up in the next episode, which for me will be about 10 minutes from now. Thanks for watching. Take it easy. I am out of here.